All right, welcome back, ladies and gentlemen, to the Chupacabra Tutorials channel. I'm your host, Larry, and today I'm going to show you how to connect your PS5 controller to your Windows PC so that you can play games over Bluetooth. So in order to do this, the first thing you need to do is have your controller in your hand charged and then make sure that the Bluetooth on your computer is turned on. Then go ahead and go to the Bluetooth and other devices window. You can just search for it in the Windows search bar in the lower left hand corner. And then go ahead on your controller, press and hold the PlayStation button and the share button, which is the sort of pill shaped button in the upper left hand corner of the touchpad. Press and hold on those until the lights on the front flash. Sort of like you're at a disco and then go ahead and click on add Bluetooth or other devices button at the top of the window on your PC. After that, click on Bluetooth and it'll search around for connectable Bluetooth devices near your computer. And this will just be listed as a generic wireless controller. Go ahead and give that a click and it'll connect your PS5 controller to your PC so that you can play games with it. In this case, I will be using PS4 Windows. So inside of DS4 Windows, I know it's connected because it shows up inside of this list. And now, as long as I have a driver that supports the PlayStation 5 controller, I can now go and play any game that I want on PC. Now the caveat here is you need to have some kind of driver, either DS4 Windows or the Steam controller drivers that come with the Steam Launcher. Those are both really great programs that'll help you play games natively for games, especially ones that don't actually have any PlayStation controller support at all. They do this by pretending that this is an Xbox controller and you're just gonna have to get used to seeing Xbox controls in most games. There are a few games that are PlayStation 5 controller ready, including Helldivers 2. And also I think Returnal as well. So anyway, that's been a brief look at how to connect your PlayStation 5 controller to your Windows PC with Bluetooth. I hope you found this helpful. If you want to remove this again from your PC later, all you have to do is go back to the Bluetooth and other devices window, click wireless controller, and then click remove device. It'll then disconnect from this controller and forget that it exists, and then you should be good to go again. It'll also warn you that it's now not connected to your system anymore. So that'd be it for this one. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I'll catch you next time. Bye everybody. And have a good one.